Hey y'all, I hope y'all are all doing very well. We're gonna look into Harry Styles and Taylor Russell's current relationship. I'm anxious to know about this myself. I knew Harry was gonna move on y'all. I just didn't realize it would be so soon. Um, I pre-shuffled to save time, so let's hop in this. How Harry feels about Taylor, what I got was ghosted i'm sorry i disappeared i needed to i needed to get away and clear my head and i also got your mind i get so pissed knowing other people can have you now is it toxic yeah i don't care i want to i want the world to know that you're mine that's what i got that's how harry is currently feeling about T uh, taylor it's kind of weird energy um what else where, where where i'm sorry y'all i'm i'm getting stuck maybe that's because the energy that they're in right now but i also got the i got i got the queen of cups i've got the queen of cups and you know that tyler perry movie is um why did i get married too and in the movie the dude tells his wife you're so used to losing in relationships you don't know when you've won i feel like there's a little bit of running going on in this relationship when I asked the cards who's ghosting, I got I got the two of wands, and this can represent this can represent the beginning of a relationship. It can also represent somebody who's stuck between two love interests. Can I say this, y'all? Like take it like a grain of salt, but could it be that Harry still has feelings for Zane? Because does Harry still have Zane in his heart? And it's making him confused about this situation. Because with the two of wands here, this man is holding a wand. And I feel like it represents Taylor. You know, the, the active relationship he's in right now. And the wand behind him. Behind him, he's not holding it. But is you know what I'm saying? I feel like he definitely watching it. He definitely keeping an eye on it. He got his back turned to Zane. But not really. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I feel I do feel like this is feelings that Harry still has left for Zane. Um, as far as the Queen of Wands, I see lots of emotional fulfillment here. I can tell that this reading is going to be straight to the point, y'all. <laughs> but I do feel a lot of compassion, kindness, love, honesty. It feels like somebody's scared of their own feelings. It really does. When I asked the cards how um, Taylor feels about Harry, I got the you're mysterious, you're, you're mysterious, gaslighting you, and my soon card. That's what I got, y'all. Um, for mysterious, it says, I can never seem to figure you out. Sometimes I feel like you're hiding something from me. Never really know where I stand with you gaslighting you i've been lying and gaslighting you you weren't crazy you were right i wasn't strong enough to admit it and then i got soon i'm gonna contact you soon so once again this is how taylor feels about harry and i feel like they're in constant contact with one another but terry terry why am i saying terry maybe because i just said something about medea's movie <laughs> it's not terry it's taylor the way taylor is feeling taylor is feeling like harry is being too mysterious um he thinks harry comes off like Harry comes off like he's hiding something and it, it makes Taylor feel like he's being lied to. They are, like I said, they're in, they're, they communicate with each other a lot. And when you're with somebody, you can tell when, you can tell when you don't have all of them. You can tell when you're in a relationship, you just know, you know, that's your intuition right there. You can tell when somebody is putting in a hundred percent or less than a hundred percent, you know what I'm saying? and i also got the hangman i i also got i got also got the hangman uh harry is procrastinating harry's procrastinating right now i'm I, i'm hearing serial dating wow um i believe is what is serial dating serial dating is someone who jumps from relationship to relationship without actually committing to something 
I'm sorry, y'all. <laughs> Something just popped up on my phone. But serial dating is somebody just committing, just jumping from relationship to relationship to relationship. I think that's what it means. And right now, it's like it's, Taylor feels like Harry is holding on to something. You know what I'm saying? And it's putting it's putting Terry in the Five of Cups energy. Terry is starting to feel like this is the Five of Cups. This man is there's three cups that's knocked down and there's two that's standing behind him. These two cups, it, it's like. Taylor is starting to feel like he may be second place to someone or something else that Harry is just not speaking about. And within the next three months, within the next three months, I got a Wounded Warrior card. And I got my Wounded Warrior Nine of Wands and I got my Page of Cards. Page of Cards. Page of Cups. I can't talk tonight. <laughs> um the th this card right here represents somebody who's resilient they don't go down without a fight but they will step back and take care of their own uh, own wounds in a relationship this is somebody that's not giving up you know what i'm saying this is not what this is not one of those instances where they're gonna let go over something uh, you know let let somebody go over something petty but this is also the energy that's kind of fed up. You know what I'm saying? This is the final straw. It's so many delays. I can, you know, I can sense when it comes to uh, Taylor, he's like, you know, j just get on with it. You know, why, why, why do I feel like I don't have all of this person? What, you know, there's parts of yourself that you're hiding. But the page of cups that I got, I, this is a good sign, y'all. This is... When I ask, I also ask the cars in this relationship if it's going to last. And upright means yes. A reverse card means no. I got the page of cups. So I, when I asked, is it going to last? I, I'm sorry. I should have I rephrased that better. I asked the cars, is this relationship going to last the rest of the year? I got a yes. So I'm, see, I'm seeing some emotional growth, willing to go the distance. Page of cups is a romantic gesture. You know what I'm saying? It's not a huge one, but it's 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 a it's a start. It's better than nothing, you know what I mean? This is also suggesting some kind of romantic gesture, uh, you know, maybe even a proposal. I don't feel like these two are gonna give up on one another just yet. It's just Harry needs to be real with his partner and sit him down and be like, Look, I am super into you, but I'm still trying to get over, you know, you know, my past. Harry could have possibly jumped in this relationship and then give himself time to heal, you know, to heal from what he had going on and his feelings in regards to Zane. Because I'm hearing, I'm hearing, uh, what's that song? Will Smith, Summer, Summertime. So maybe this is, maybe they've been going together since the summer. Maybe something happened. And I'm talking... I'm talking so stupidly because I'm picking up on three energies, y'all. And it's Zane, it's Harry, and it's Taylor. When I start getting so stupid and like talking like this, it's because I'm picking up on a lot of energies. And I truly apologize. I feel like this is going to work out between these two if Harry just starts making heart decisions right now he's making head over heart decisions he's like okay i got two people that i love and i care about and you know if i can parliamentalize and put this person here and put that person here and another person i never know but you know what people we're very complex we're very intuitive we have more than six cents you know his he's harry hasn't realized yet that taylor is picking up on the way that he feels but he's going to it's gonna happen really soon probably within the next couple of weeks even if it hasn't happened this week and it's gonna make him it's gonna it's gonna make him step up and he's probably gonna be like all right you know i am going to try my best to keep this other person out of my heart you know i feel like harry might be self-sabotaging this stuff because he didn't give himself a chance when you don't give yourself a chance to heal from past feelings or past relationship or, you know, somebody, you are going to self-sabotage things. So I do feel like they have a great thing going, y'all. I do feel like it's completely authentic. They love one another. And uh, this is this is the energy that Harry really needs to be in. Zane is in this energy. And 
feel like for the most part harry is harry's being very truthful with him especially about his feelings you know the conversations that they're having they real and authentic but it's just he need he needs to open up what he what he really feels about you know zane you know i'm not necessarily saying list any names but hey just know that there is a third party i do have some i do have some wounds i do have some abandonment issues because i'm picking up on that as well um so yeah i just feel like <laughs> I feel like this could be this, this could be normal. This could be a very very loving relationship. You know what I'm saying? It feels like I, I gotta say this. I don't want y'all to hate, hate hate me for this because I know there's some Harry fans out there. But when I feel picked up on the serial dating, I feel like it's Harry, and I feel like Harry was like, okay, you know, Zane is my person. So until I can get with Zane, I'm just going to preoccupy myself with somebody else. It's, it feels like he's so used to being emotionally unfulfilled that when he feels the feeling with somebody it makes him scared and he's at a pause and then that's when he becomes confused he becomes confused when he starts having feelings for two people at once and realizing oh shit you know this person is you know making my heart pound i think this is something similar that happened between him and uh taylor swift it's too many taylors going on y'all but i hope y'all could get some understanding out of that i was very excited to read it. if you have any questions um in regards to the reading i will pull some more but this is all i'm gonna do for tonight so until next time love y'all bye